We've walked around a few times now, Dan. I'm asking you to leave me alone. I'm telling you, I'm standing right here. I'm just telling you, I'm asking you to leave me alone. So just so you guys know. Just so you guys know, Chili lied about wrestling in high school. I didn't never wrestled in high school. No, I didn't. I contacted his high school. That was weird, wasn't it? That guy was psycho. He was really a psycho. I thought you really knew him. No, no, no. No, he's. I, I mean, oh yeah. Oh, I'm yeah. just telling you. I'm gonna go around this corner where it's dark. Come on, Dan. If, if you follow me around the corner, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna defend myself. My car is out. I'm just letting you know. I'm just letting you know. Okay. I'm just letting you know, Dan. I'm just letting you know, Dan. I'm just letting you know, my friends. You now, you now attack me. I thought you came to fight me. You want to fight me? Is that what you want to do? No, no. You go. Over. I was ready to beat up the gangster too. I just heard enough. Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we're taking another look at Chili DeCastro while he meets one of his biggest fans out on the street. And then, I don't know, he tries to like lure him around a corner for a grinder hookup or something, all before figuring out he's hitting on a man and that's when things get spicy. So let's get this video started. Crime suppression? Did they, did they do something wrong? Did, did they do something wrong? So they did something wrong? Okay. So it's just, no, I, I, there's lots of people watching. I just wanted to see if you just let us know what's going on, that's all. Yeah. Oh, open containers? Okay, thanks, appreciate that. Thank you. So, um, they have, uh, they have open containers of alcohol. And uh, now there's, uh, because of open containers of alcohol, um, it looks like you got uh, one, two, three, four five co cops here because these guys have um open, open bottles of alcohol five 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 cops and uh, all three are in torture cuffs all three of them are in torture cuffs and so right now each one of them they're it, it, you know your your shoulders aren't meant to do what the what, what's happening to those guys shoulders right now their shoulders right now hurt and their wrists likely hurt a lot. And they're in this position right now because they had an open container of alcohol. So this is, you know, and these are the resources. When, when LAPD says that, you know, that, that crime is out of control here, this is where our resources are going into these three men here. And these guys probably, hey officer, do you, do you have a business card? Would that be, do you have a business card? Is that okay? Thank you, I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. So he's gonna give me his business card afterwards. Um, um, LAPD here, I'm not sure if you guys know this, but here in Los Angeles, we have a, we have a, a crime spree, a crime spike going on in, um, in Los Angeles. But unfortunately, we have put our resources into an open bottle. They have an open bottle. They, um, they should not have been drinking on they shouldn't have been drinking um on hollywood boulevard i suppose i mean i guess if you were walking down the walk of fame and you were like let's have a beer just this is a, a friendly reminder to everybody that the cops if you have an open bottle they're looking for you over there right there there's the evidence guys there it is right there oh my god there it is right there they have an open bottle these guys oh gosh bling it i'm so sorry for the language all right that's it young man no bible stories for you tonight <laughs> so at this point chili's gonna do the victimless crime trope that he's always brandishing about and meanwhile I've never really been to a place other than perhaps Mardi Gras where you're allowed to drink on the streets. We're about to meet Chili's first fan out on the streets, but as you can see, this is a more of a passing interest in Chili. You know, I got a lot of people watching and they're just, they're just curious as to what, what's going on. You know what I mean? Because when you're talking about taking the guy's liberty and putting him in jail, you know. You know, for his arrest, they were drinking in public on a public street, right? You can't drink. Alcohol. Drinking in public on a public street. Right I, I know. I saw. I saw. The, I saw the evidence. Yeah, so right now he's writing a citation for that. Okay. Writing a citation, and these two guys are gonna get to go. Yes. 
Maybe, maybe, maybe we can take him out of the torture cuffs since he's he's caught. Hey, maybe you're fucking just getting fucking money and power off your video. Me? But. Hey, sir, can you go stand over there, please? Over there, please. I'm, I'm I'm okay. I'm all right. Oh, we're all right. What's your name? He just took my property. No, what was he your just, name? He just took my property. What was your name? He just took my. Hey, sir, can you please? He just took my. He just, he just took my property. You see that? You see that? I don't know, Chili. It looks to me like he was just defending himself. Am I right, Beta Boy? See, I mean, like I'm, I'm, a, I'm a law-abiding citizen. I'm for law and order. I'm not for taking property. I, I would never take something off of you like that. That's really rude to him to do. But I'm not gonna fight anybody. You know what I mean? I, I'm, I'm here for, I'm here for, I'm just here to document this and ask, you know, try to, try to have a conversation, a reasonable conversation. See, like, it's those guys you gotta worry about, you know what I mean? Because they're cool right now, they could snap any second and act like a jackass. <laughs> They're cool right now. They could snap any second and act like a jackass. A few minutes later. If you follow me around the corner, what I'm going to do is I'm going to defend myself. My car is out. I'm just letting you know. I'm just letting you know. Okay. I'm just letting you know, Dan. I'm just letting you know, Dan. I'm just letting you know. My friends. You want to back up? You've now, you're now attacking me. Back the up. And you better do it now. Or I'll beat the. Let's back up a bit. Get me and you together. Yeah, you're up here. You're like up here. <laughs> Say something. I'm not. I'm not being. You had a motel or shift? This guy's racist. Oh. This guy. Nah, I don't think you're racist. I just think you're weird. Every cop not racist. No, no, this guy. Not the cop, the guy. Some people, you know. So can you guys, will you guys tell us now? Can you guys, t I mean, can you tell us now, sir? I mean, I've been really polite to you guys, man. I, 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 I haven't, I have, but I haven't been rude at all. I've been okay. really calm, dude. Oh, me I've, treat, I've treated you guys really kindly. Can you, you, can you just tell the public, can, if, if you have a beer on Hollywood Boulevard, does that mean you go to jail? Do you get, I mean, I didn't realize that guy had a warrant, but do you get arrested for that? Do you so get, if you commit a crime, you will be held accountable, that's it. And yet again, Chile having to learn the basic rules of society. Not allowed to have open alcohol on the streets, Kate always wins, and if you want to get less attention, you have to close down the grinder app. Perhaps one of his other three phones is matching with people in his pocket without him knowing. Oh, he knew. Dude, do you want to identify yourself? Daniel Clement. Da you're Daniel Clem you're yeah. Daniel Clement? Yes. Yeah. So, you're, you're the guy that thinks you could fight me? This is Daniel Clement. He thinks he could fight me. He contacts me. He's contacted me like a hundred ways possible. He thinks he could fight me. <laughs> I don't care, dude. <laughs> you're Dan Clement. You're the guy that said you wanted to fight me. Turn to the side. Show him. Show, show him. Show him yourself. Show people who you are. Dan. This is not his name's Dan Clement. Yes. Show them. Layer upon layer of dormant relaxed muscle waiting like a panther to pounce on its quivering prey. I never trans lines. All those things? You never did. Okay. Anything yeah. else? I mean, you, you, did you drive? Why did you lie did, about did it? Did you drive Why over here? Why did you lie about it? I'm not lying about anything, but, but, but let me ask you a question. You want did, me to show you, you Lester? Did you, you want me to show you, you Shane Malcolm Lester? What happened with that guy? Um, so I think the guy I've never had seen a, somebody getting I think the, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, container of alcohol. Oh, shit. Dude, this, guy's, uh, this guy's, uh, this guy's having, I'm sorry, I don't have it. This guy's having a hard time breathing. He's hyperventilating. <laughs> He's really having hyperventilating. How you doing, man? Doing well. What's your name, dude? What's your name? <laughs> he never was part of training camps in Dallas. Yeah, yeah. Ken Shamrock? Yeah. I don't know him. Ken Shamrock? Mm -hmm. I don't know him, and I would not support any 
one who does these things. And you said you were good friends with them, right? Yeah. I, you I, said you were good I am, friends with them. I, I was good friends with Ken is, Shamrock. That's a fact. They did not even knowing you, dumbass. Yeah, because I, I tore down a blue striped flag Bullshit. in Dallas, Texas. Bullshit. You're so, a liar. You're a hey, fucking liar. Okay. You yeah. didn't tore so, down shit. You I just did. never trained with them. I did, actually. No, you didn't. I, I did, actually. Did. No, you did. You did? You did? did? Okay. Where's you, your evidence? Where'd you come from, though, Dan? I live here. I live in L.A. Okay. So now you're here and you've confronted me. You got it out. You're a liar. Okay. That's a bullshit liar. Like you're stalking me. I'm standing me. in public property. Right, but I've, I've walked I'm around a few times now, Dan. You know, I'm asking you I'm to leave me alone. I'm telling okay. you I'm standing right here. I'm just telling you, I'm asking you I'm to leave me alone. I'm telling you I'm standing right here. What's going to end up happening, Dan, is, is you're going to assault me. And, and I'm going to ask you to leave me alone now. And I'm going to walk around this corner My right here. My car is where, that way, too. So where it's dark. My car is that way, too. If you walk this way, though, I'm going to show car you. Is that way. I'm just going to come this way. My car is that way. Well, I'm just telling you, I'm going to go around this corner where it's dark. Come on, Dan. Tilly, I'm sorry, but this is not how Grinder works. Stop trying to lure Dan into a dark, dark alley with you. He doesn't want to feel your mighty morphin power ring. But this got me kind of thinking. Tilly here doesn't know how to use the proximity system on Grinder, so here's a quick tutorial for Chili or... Anybody else, I guess. We don't judge here on this channel. As soon as the page opens, it will show you a list of people on the nearby. The people at the top of the list are closest to you, and the lower you go down the list, they get further away. And with that map, you can drag around, and anywhere under the pin, it will show the guys in that location. Now, if you don't mind, Chili, I have to now go explain to my wife why I was searching how Grinder works. If you follow me around the corner, what I'm going to do is I'm going to defend myself. My car is out. I'm just letting you know. I'm just letting you know. Okay. I'm just letting you know, Dan. I'm just letting you know, Dan. I'm just letting you know. My friends. You want to back hey. up? You've now, you're now attacking me. I'm back the up. 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 And you better do it now. I'm up. Or I'll I'm beat sorry. the dog I'm shit sorry. out of you. I'm no, I'm, I'm done. Sorry. I'm sorry. Get the I'm out of here. Get the I'm out of here sorry. now. I'm done. I'm sorry. Don't you ever try to victimize me. Security. I will beat the out of you. Security. I'm done. Oh, I thought you wanted to fight me. I thought you came to fight me. You want to. Me? Me, please. Is that what you no. want to do? No, no. You gonna back throw? Up. Back up. Back up. throw? Back up. Okay. You don't even know who you want to throw with. I don't want to throw with you. Walk him to Hollywood. Walk him. Walk him to Hollywood. Welcome to Hollywood, Chili. You've already annoyed that nice young man there. He'd like to repay the favor if you'll allow it. All jokes aside, does anybody else think that Chili spotted a gun in this next section? Because you can almost feel his butt pucker up right through the video even. Your ass got saved. He saved you. It's live, bro. Go ahead. Where's the phone at? You're live. Where's the phone at? You're live. We live, homie, every you're time. You're live. I got it. I got it. You got it, homie. No, no, you're live, bro. Hey, bring it up. Hey, hey. homie. Hey. You're, you're live, bro. And just so you just so you know, man, listen. You know. Not that easy, homie. Yeah. I, I wish somebody would. I wish you would. I don't want to fight anybody. I want to walk. I want. To, I want to go home. Listen, God bless you. I'm out. God bless you, fucking ass. One second. I gotta go dark. That's gonna be it for me today. Let me know in the comments if you think that guy showed Chili a gun. Maybe hit the like button, think about subscribing, or even becoming one of my fantastic patrons or members. Thank you very much and have yourselves a good day.